So over here in Microsoft OneNote, you can easily utilize grids uh, in drawing to draw something in proportion. In order to do that, I'm going to go into my draw section right here. And here you can see that I can uh, select shapes. Over here inside, uh, in the options, as you can see, there's a, a snap to grid as an option provided to me. So if I were to turn this off and then drag, you can see that the drawing is quite smooth and I can create anything of my choice. I can also click and drag or hold shift that is going to create a proportional drawing right here. I'm holding shift right now. And if I were to release this, you can see that a proportional drawing has been made. Uh, but if I were to go over here and check on snap to grid, if you were to click this, you can see that it actually snaps onto grid and it only works in a unit form as you can see right here. And in order to view that grid, I can go into view option right here. And in the rule line option, I can enable the grid line. So I'm going to enable this out just like this. Going to go over here, rule line color. Right now it's set to none. And now I'm going to go for something like a tan color and you can see the grid right there. So now you can use this as a guideline and if the and if this uh, snap to grid is on, the drawing will snap to these grids right here, as you can see. So I'm going to go over here into draw section. You can see that snap to grid is on. So I can easily create something like a bar graph. For example, let's say, say I want to take only three units. So if I were to click and drag, you can see that everything snaps out into the place as I want to. So uh, I want to create another one. For example, this is one unit, another unit right here. So I can take this and three units again. So I'm going to use three units right here. And I'm going to take three units just like this. And I'm going to take three units over here as well, just like that. All right, hit control Z. I want to leave one box unit right here, three units for the graph, just like that. Okay, so I'm going to select all of these, delete this out. I want to create the, um, something like a bar graph. So I'm going to take this line right here. So let me just click and drag the line right here. There you go. So just still this section right here. And then I'm going to click and drag and hold shift so that the line is straight, just like this. Okay, right till here. I'm going to select all of it over here. Click and drag and keep it somewhere over here. So once I have grid as an outline I, and I have snap to grid option, you can easily see that I can create something in a proportion. So that is how you can use snap to grid option inside of Microsoft OneNote to create uh, proportional drawings. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.